Good morning, everyone. It's Shannon Mattern coming to you live from snowy Columbus, Ohio. Welcome to my broadcast. That was a weird angle. Um, welcome to my broadcast. Um, thank you so much for joining me this morning. Um, today, I want to talk to you about five more ways to get traffic to your website without using SEO. Good morning, Abby. How are you? Nice to see you here. Um, so for those of you that don't know me, I am Shannon Mattern. I'm a WordPress ex expert and I teach WordPress for free to solopreneurs over at www.wp-bff.com where I have my free five-day website challenge um, that will show you exactly how to build an entire WordPress site in just five days. So if you have been struggling with WordPress or you um, need to build a website, it's a perfect place for you. I teach you all the basics, so hop on over there and um, check it out. So thank you so much for joining me this morning. Today I want to talk about five ways to get more traffic to your website um, without using SEO. And the number one key to doing this is um, giving before you ask. So it's not a quick strategy. It's not one of those like, you know, build, you know, get a hundred thousand people to your site this week. It's something that's going to take time and it's definitely worth the effort that you put in because the, the rewards that you will, um, reap from that is so much more than just getting a hit to your website. So the golden rule of, you know, any trap like social using social media to drive traffic to your site, um, building relationships on Periscope is just to give before you ask. So um, one of the strategies that I have used that has worked really really well for me is to promote my five day challenge in Facebook groups. However. I also spend a lot of time interacting with people, commenting, um, liking their stuff, um, visiting their blogs, commenting on their blog posts, um, interacting and engaging and building a relationship with people so that I'm not just like a fly-by-night spammer in your Facebook group just popping in to, you know, promote my stuff on promo days. Now, there are a few Facebook groups that um, that have fantastic promo days. <laughs> Thank you so much. That's awesome. Thanks, Abby. Like the Smart Passive Income Facebook group, which is one of my favorites, except for... Um, I, I feel like there's so many people in there right now that really... I don't know how to say it. It's kind of it's getting kind of spammy and I'm sorry. It's getting kind of spammy, so it's hard to like interact and help people in there because th that's kind of not I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. But um spending time in those Facebook groups and helping people and answering their questions and trying to point them in the right direction is super valuable to building relationships. Um, which eventually, when it's time for you to post a link to your site, people are going to recognize your name and be like, oh yeah, she's the real deal because she's helped so many people um, with that problem. I, I'm already like building social proof. I'm already proving that, um, proving that I know what I'm talking about. So that's one way to drive traffic to your website without SEO is to just be visible, be helpful, answer people's questions, engage with them, and then when it's time to promote, um, your name's already going to be recognized, which is awesome. Another strategy that I like to use that has worked well for me in the past is, and I actually just learned this, and it resulted in a couple of offers for guest posts. I was listening to a podcast with um, Brian Harris of videofruit.com and I'd never heard of him and I think it's even like an older podcast in my list, you know, in my queue of podcasts and he suggested that, you know, you sign up for all these email lists and because you want to learn something because you got a freebie from someone and it has some action steps that, you know, you probably took and, you know, if you took those steps, you got some sort of result, hopefully a positive result. So why not the next time they send you an email, reply and tell them 
what you did and how what your results were. Hey, good morning, Stacy. So happy to see you here. Um, so I tried that. I was like, okay, so I've gotten so many good results from a lot of these um, freebies that I've signed up for, like the 30 day list building challenge, which is what you know I've been going through in the month of January. I've got fantastic results from going through that. So I replied to the next email that I got from Natalie Lucier. <laughs> yes, I know. I'm actually like late for work right now, which is crazy. I should be probably in my car driving to work. <laughs> <laughs> but instead, I'm like, I got to do my morning scope. Um, <laughs> yeah, I know, right? It is. It's a really simple thing. And I replied to her and I said, thank you so much for providing this information. I just want to share with you my results after a year of following your strategies. And she wrote back, I would love to have you um, write a guest post on that for my blog, which I was like, sweet, that's awesome. So I complete like I you know, got so excited. I wrote the post in a day and I sent it off to her and hopefully it'll be published in the next couple weeks. Um, and I did that also with Becca Tracy of the uncaged life. Um, she has inspired me quite a bit. I've, you know, I, her, her, um, Hey, nice package course was absolutely fantastic. It helped me put together my BFF Academy. I have a link to her. It's just a, it's a PDF course, but it breaks down how to price things, how everything like that, like all the nitty gritty. I have a link to that on my resources page, www.wp-bff.com forward slash resources if you want to check it out. But that course was like a huge um, step forward for me in my business. And so the next email I got from Becca Tracy, I was like, hey, I just want to let you know, um, you know, here's what results I got from, you know, your course. I love your emails. Your Facebook group's fantastic. I get so many um, clients or, you know, subscribers from being able to post on your promo day. I really appreciate everything you do. And she responded back, um, hey, do you want to join my elite mastermind group? Which was, I was like, what? Like, that's so cool. Because she saw that I was like taking action with her stuff, getting results. And so she invited me to join her mastermind group. So um, I may or may not participate. I'm still um, thinking about it because I've got, I'm doing private coaching, which I highly suggest that you do if you're not already doing it. I'm doing it with the fabulous Vicki Fitch. So if you feel like you need someone to just, help you figure out what to do and push you forward. Um, Vicky's fantastic. Yeah, Becca Tracy, the uncagedlife.com. Um, her stuff is fantastic. So you definitely check her out. She's a great person to follow for online business. And she's like no BS, which is awesome. Um, so those are some great things that I that I've been doing. So every time I get an email from someone that I've like gotten major value from, that's awesome, Abby. Yeah, it's 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 like um, you know I'm great at WordPress, but I'm not natural at online business. You know, so there's or just even business. So having a, a coach to kind of push me past the things I'm afraid of. It, yeah, absolutely game changer push me past the things I'm afraid of and, and help get me on the right track and help me think through some decisions that I wouldn't have considered. Yeah, she's exceptional. She's absolutely fantastic. So everybody should go to vickyfitch.com. She does a free 20 minute consultation, which my 20 minute consultation with her just gave me so much value that um, I couldn't, you know, not sign up with her. I'm like, if I got this much out of free 20 minutes with her. Imagine what's going to happen, um, you know, after I sign up for coaching. So I did a 12 week coaching package with her. I've never, I, I, 12 weeks ago is so different from now. I just re-signed for another 12 weeks. I mean, I've, um, grown my list faster, made more income, had more confidence. I feel like I can handle most of the situations that come my way. Um, ever since signing up with her. So she knows what she's talking about for sure. I wish I could catch more of her scopes too. Um, cause I, I'm sure they're extremely valuable just based on what, um, what I'm getting out of our time together. But, um, so back to, you know, responding to those emails so much, you're, you're creating relationships once again, 
you know, you're giving a testimonial back to them and you're not even asking for anything in, in return. But what I love as, you know, an online entrepreneur who communicates via emails, I love hearing back from people that say how much I have helped them and how much action that they've taken. And I'm going to start, you know, when I hear back from those people, I'm going to start, you know, offering opportunities for them to do more. No, <laughs> that's awesome. She mentioned me last night, Scott. That's cool. You know, so when people do respond to me, you know, I always thank them. I write back, but you know, now I'm like, okay, what well, I can be more like my mentors and offer them more up op another opportunity to, you know, for me to promote them or, or something like that because they really are taking action. So I'm excited about that strategy. That's been a fantastic one for me so far. So giving before you ask, and sometimes you don't even have to ask. The opportunities just appear when you give. Um, another strategy that I love doing because I love getting comments on my blog posts. Um, I wish I got more comments on my blog posts, but I don't really post. I don't promote. I need to better promote my blog posts, actually. Um, but is to go onto a blog post, one that has like super actual information, and it's the same concept of the email, but just to say, hey, thanks, I followed the steps that you put out there, and here's what happened for me, because then it validates for everybody else that, that reads their post that, yes, this actually worked, and, and, you know, this person knows what they're talking about, and it, it they'll see those comments, and, and it starts to build a relationship, so... You know, even though you're not getting a link back to your site when you do things like that, these are ways to start building relationships with influencers that then you can work together later down the road. So they're not instantaneous. It's not going to send, you know, 100 people to your website right now, but it is laying the groundwork for future traffic, future relationships, um, future subscribers um, to your site. So... I like to take the slow, <laughs> the slow and steady course. I mean, if there were something that worked that legitimately got me a ton of traffic to my website that wasn't, you know, that were going to be people that were really interested in what I was doing, of course I would do that. And I'm sure I'll find that thing. And when I do, I'm going to share it with you guys right here because I know that you would love to have that. But, you know, working super hard on SEO um, probably just depends on your niche, but if you're in a super saturated niche like I am, like people that do WordPress websites, um, we have to think of more creative ways to connect with people. You know, another super saturated niche is how to start an online business or how to lose weight or get fit. So you have to think of other ways to get in front of the people that you want to get in front of and not try to worry about SEO and do I have the right keywords and oh my gosh, I'm on page 35 of Google. That stuff does not matter. There are people out there that need what you have and the way to get to them is to build relationships with the places that they're already hanging out in a legitimate, genuine way where you really are, you know, just building the relationship and seeing what comes of it. I'm not like, okay, I'm going to comment on their blog and then respond to their email and then two weeks later I'm going to ask them to do this, you know, it's just let it happen, just take the actions to start connecting with them and then the rest will happen naturally. So thank you so much for tuning into my Periscope today. Um, I really appreciate you guys coming on and Stacey and Abby, thank you so much for being here and giving me hearts. You guys are awesome. Thank you, Dr. Cuisine. I appreciate you being here. Um, if you want to learn more about WordPress or MailChimp or anything that I'm doing, you can check out my website, www.wp-bff.com. And I share all my favorite tools on my resources page over there. And you can also join my free five-day website challenge, even here on Periscope, finding out. Yes, exactly. I also uh, like to follow my followers' followers. <laughs> <laughs> that makes sense. I love doing that to see because I know like I kind of started out with this core group of people that you know we all know each other but then I like to look at like Stacy's followers and follow who she's following and and Vicky's and, and everybody and just kind of connect that way popping on a periscope and saying hi to people and giving them hearts that's a great way to connect with people so thank you so much for joining me this morning I really probably ought to 
get to work now. So um, I will see you guys uh, bright and early tomorrow morning. And yeah.